welcome back to my youtube channel oracle gp online training so in this tutorial we'll be covering how to downgrade the database from 19c to 12c step by step this is the second method that we are discussing previously we have uh, seen how to downgrade the database using the cat upgrade cat downgrade uh, utility and uh, this tutorial is basically based upon the flashback option that we have okay so um, in order to uh, before we can proceed, I'll request all the new friends to please subscribe our YouTube channels. And uh, if you want any personal training or any personal support uh, with respect to Oracle database administration, you, you can have contact me on uh, given contact details or the email ID. Also, you can connect me through various social media platforms. We have previous a lot of uh, uh, tutorials to, uh, already covered. You can just go through by playlist wise also. and. Uh, Regarding the important announcement, uh, if you are interested about Oracle DB Ultimate uh, full course, you can enroll it only by paying 5,000 rupees. Previously, this same course was available at 6,000 rupees. And also, you, if, you are, if you are interested about any documentation related to our tutorials, you can get all the collection of uh, you know, documents by paying only 2,000 rupees. So this is about the announcement. And if, if you want any personal training, you can just get in touch with me on the given uh, contact details. So let's start today's agenda. That is how to downgrade the database uh, using um, flashback option. So in order to do this, uh, um, what I did, I, I just followed a few of the steps. Like uh, first we have to upgrade the database because uh, normally uh, downgrade condition comes when, when we are, while doing the up upgrade, if we are failing with some uh, issues, so we can do the downgrade also. Okay. So in order to do that, uh, uh, we can have the, uh, system ready. So what I did, I upgraded the database from 12C to 19C. And these are a few of the steps that I followed and my database is already upgraded to 19C if you can see this one. And I'll, I'll show you the sum of the output so that you can understood. And if you if you want like how to manually upgrade the database, you can follow our previous tutorial. It is a complete uh, tutorial on the same. And even though you can refer our previous tutorial where we have uh, uh, covered this section also. Okay. So I'll, I'll show you the current state of the database so that you have you have better understanding about this. Okay, so you can see all the data in my database is upgraded from 12C to 19C. And uh, <clears throat> so we, our target will be to downgrade this database using the flashback option. Okay, and uh, so, so in order to do this kind of uh, downgrade, uh, and the first and important part is uh, you should have the flashback feature enabled. So previously during the time of upgrade, I created one restore point with the name before upgrade 19C. Okay. And this restore point basically will help us to downgrade the database for, uh, using the flashback option. So in order to do this uh, downgrade, what we have to do first, uh, we have to ver re verify the restore point and flashback the database to restore point. So in order to do this, first, we need to bring down the database, start up in the mount state. So currently our database is open in retight mode. So first thing we have to bring down the database too. And then we have to bring uh, bring up the database in mount state. Okay. So generally the rollback condition will come when, when we have failed and uh, failed situation for the upgrade. So as a rollback plan, you should always have the, this plan ready. Okay. So now our database is down. Now we'll, start the database in mount state. So currently we are in the 19 CDB home and we are bringing down and bringing up the database in mount state. Okay. So there is a simple command through which you can do the flashback, but in order to do the flashback, you should have the restore point previously created. So we already have the restore point with the name before upgrade 19 C. So I'm using the same um, restore point and I'm doing the flashback database to restore point before upgrade so you can see the flashback restore starts so within few minutes of time this uh, flashback will complete and then we have to proceed for the next round of steps
now we can see the flashback is completed successfully and uh, we can see this uh, flashback complete completion message is also there in the alert log of the database and currently our database is mounted so we have to open the database in a reset log mode since we have performed the flashback operation okay so as soon as we run the alter database open reset log commands we can see there is there will be some um, reset log operation will happen in the day in the background but i'm surely say that this this uh, command will fail with uh, some more error because uh, it is expected behavior so as soon as this will completes or you can say the reset reset log is completes then we have to start the database again from the 12c home so currently we are running with the 19c home in the next step that we have to um, start the database from the 12c home so we can see the alert log of the database like uh, clearing the online reset log files with a sequence that means a reset log operation is uh, getting performed in the background so at this stage we we should get some error let's uh, wait for some few more minutes and we'll see so this is our second method that we are discussing today and uh, previously we have seen how to downgrade the database using the cat downgrade utility if you if you want you can just go through that uh, tutorial and i've given the link in the description also so as expected the error is encountered here and we can see the alert log of database also so with this database gets terminated automatically okay and uh, now the next step will be start the database from the 12c home so what i'll do i'll just exit from here and i'll reload the 12c profile that is uh, by running this default profile on this set setup so we'll just re verify the current uh, i mean the reloaded profile so we can see the 12c profile here after this we have to start the database so we can just start the database either in mount state or you can directly start the database using the startup command so i just start so in between uh, we have to make sure the p file sp file has to be uh, all um, should be in place otherwise we'll get um, unnecessary errors so the database open is also completed and we are currently logged in with 12c home you can see the database version is 12c and this is a 12c okay after the, doing this we can just uh, re-verify the details about the database like uh, status of uh, db registry history and uh, you can see the 12c re related uh, registry history view and uh, all the valid components and uh, apart from this you can also verify the invalid object forms if the in if there is an invalid object count you can run the utlrp again and apart from this we can also have to verify the db registry and the db registry history okay. so we can see that there is no information with respect to upgrade of the previously that we seen okay so that means we can say that if you see here the previous output so we are seeing the upgraded from 12c to 19c those information has been now gone because uh, we have rolled back everything using the flashback feature of the database okay so the first and most important uh, point for about the flashback feature we should have the restore point that we already have and because of that we have uh, we are able to do the flashback uh, database to the restore point and uh, once that is done then we have to open the database in reset log mode and during the reset log operation we'll find out there will be some error also so that is that is uh, ignorable from after that we have to using the 12c profile you can so uh, okay we have to start the database and uh, we can just re-verify so this is one of the method through which you can do the uh, downgrade of your database from 19c to 12c and this this can be a rollback plan for your any upgrade of the database i hope you have understood everything about this tutorial if you have any confusion you can uh, reach me out okay so with this uh, we have completed today agenda like uh, downgrade of from 19c to 12c step by step using the flashback option and uh, thanks for watching this tutorial have a great day uh, please do subscribe our channel if you have any queries please reach out to me thanks uh, once again have a great day